In this section, I will discuss generation of association rules for balance scale dataset. So, first step, very simple, drag and drop your balance scale dataset. This time I won't go into the details of cross-validation uh, operator for testing and training. I have already used them twice uh, or in the previous uh, algorithms. So, this time I will be just concentrating on creating association rules. So, there is an op operator called generate create association rules, drag and drop create association rules. Alright, now we have got the association rules operator, but the thing is it doesn't take input the data set directly, it expects uh, frequency item sets as an input. So to generate frequency item sets, we have another operator called the FP growth operator. So drag and drop FP growth operator. But the problem is not yet solved because the frequency growth operator expects uh, binomial attributes in its input. So we, uh, whereas our data set has, has nominal attributes, so we need a nominal to binomial convert nominal to binomial converter. So now we connect the ports. The FP growth output is frequency sets. We give it as an input to the association rules and the rules as output. Alright, now let's hit play or run. Here you go. Here we see that no rules were found. Why no rules were found? Let us check out. In the FP growth operator, the minimum support value is very high. We can reduce it to say very low value, say 0.1. In create association rules, we have minimum confidence 0.8. That seems fine. Let's see how it works. Again, no rules found. Now maybe we should decrease the value of minimum confidence. We decrease it to very minimum 0.1 and minimum support we further decrease it 0 0.01 so this time it is taking some time it seems yes here we go so there are a lot of rules now there are about 300 rules well for a 625 instance data set 300 rules is a lot so we need to change the parameters a bit we change the confidence value to point 0.9 let's see no rules found alright now point 0.8 confidence value again no rules found alright let's check point 0.5 maybe again no rules found so uh huh. The problem right now, actually, is this in this nominal to binomial operator. We haven't by default this operator does not convert the uh, labels or special attributes into nominal form into binomial form. But we want to include the special attributes. Here we go. Now the, it should work quite well. Let's see. Yes, here are a number of rules again. There are. 50 rules which is again too much for such a small data set let's increase the required confidence value to 0.9 now there are 20 rules so as you increase the value of the confidence level the rules will be decreased so now let me increase this confidence value to 0.95 let us see how many rules we have we got. Yes, we've got just 12 rules now. And let us now briefly discuss these rules. The premises and conclusion. So it says if, let us go into the text view. If the right weight, here we go. If the right weight is 5 and right distance is 5, the result is R. So this is very simple, this is true. Simply if the right weight is 1, if right weight is 5 and left weight is 1, result is usually R. So this is also pretty much true. So you see most of them make sense. 
but they may not all of them be correct so similarly this right rule is pretty much true if left weight and left distance both are 5 the result is left but it is also false when the right weight and left distance both are 5 then it, in that case it will be balanced so the rules are not always 100% accurate but the, the confidence value and such parameters adjust the accuracy of these rules so this was about the generation of association rules for balance scale data set